Warning, this is a pest control video and contains footage of animals being shot. If this is likely to offend, then please don't watch. Please see the description below for more information on this video. There's also some links you may find useful. I'm back at the recycling centre again. I visited about three or four days ago but there was pretty much no activity whatsoever. There was maybe one rat all night. I took a shot on that rat and I missed. So I called it an evening, packed up and left. So tonight there was a lot more activity. A lot more rats about. I think I got 14 in all. This one is on the right hand side of the recycling centre as you first go in I pointed it out on the previous episode there seems to be a lot of rats hiding in that area so that's the first one I've taken down first one of the evening in amongst a load of rubble and junk this one thinks he's safe that's only the case if you remain hidden, however. There's a few moments like this one where there's a rat about, but it's just not sitting still enough for a shot. Ideally, I want a headshot, so I'd rather wait till I can get a good one. This rat didn't sit still long enough for me to get a clear shot. Kept on the move, kept jumping around. But he disappeared along here, just hit behind this what looked like a big wooden beam. So I'm just tracking around the beam just to make sure that he doesn't get out and that I, if he does I can see where he could run to. After this video clip there's some graphic photographs coming up so if you don't want to see those I'll probably look away for about the next 40-50 seconds. I just want to make sure he hasn't escaped when I've been looking around and there's a pan back along here he is sticking his head out. Nice straight on headshot. I'm happy with that. I'm pretty sure at the time that was a clean headshot and he's dead. And there's helicopter tail going there. Jumping around which is what's expected from a headshot. But because I've stayed on him and he's jumping around I just wanted to make sure that everybody was happy that he was dead. So I follow up with a heart and lung shot here. The pellet's gone straight through. So I'm now happy he is absolutely dead. There he is lying there. There's the headshot. And the pellet's gone straight through and taken the contents of his head out. Stick your head above the parapet. You'll get it shot. There's another one down. One less rat. Just tracking along the rubbish pile there, having a look, see if there's anything sticking the head out. Spot some eyes there. There he is. Going for a little mooch. Fortunately he's not staying out long enough for me to take a shot. He's another rat minding his own business. this cheeky rat just as I take the shot he seems to pull back and avoids it altogether so I'm trying again doesn't avoid it that time though he definitely didn't see that one coming just standing there tracking this rat under a pallet waiting for a nice clear shot and who should come in the top left it's One-Eyed Willie. He was in a previous episode. I took a shot on him and missed. Just tried again there. And I think I pulled the rifle to the right slightly, so the pellet didn't land on target. Either that or One-Eyed Willie has a force field around him. His friend doesn't, however. His friend's just taken a whack to the head. And his helicopter tail shows you it's lights out for him. So after one eyed Willie managed to dodge another pellet, and his friend took a pellet, 
the rats around that area decide to go into hiding and they bury themselves underneath so I pack up from this area and move on move on to the pile of rubbish behind me back over on the main rubbish pile this one's taken a wander a wander outside he's not standing still for shot though he's, he's off into hiding just to the left there is that black corrugated pipe where I shot that rat for sticking his head up before this looks like one of his friends going for a wander so he disappears behind this plate here and it looks like he's trying to burrow in so I'm waiting around for him to come back out for a shot now bearing in mind I'm about probably about 15 feet up so I'm taking a shot down onto the rat so I'm waiting for him to show enough of himself so I can take that shot I'm happy and I hit him there so that hits him smack in the back of the head so that I would say has probably severed his spinal cord and it's exited the rat through the front about 20 seconds after that last shot I moved back to where that previous rat had buried underneath that bit of plastic lagging and disappeared he sticks his head up so I take another shot and I miss this is a lucky rat I take a shot and it misses but when I play it back in slow motion it looks like just as I commit to the shot he pulls back so you can see the pellet flying in he pulls back and he dodges the pellet all together very quick this one wasn't as quick to avoid the pellet hit him with a headshot there that's a 35 yard shot I was confident it hit but there's a lot of kicking around there and the dust is making it look worse so I just wanted to be sure and give it a follow up shot he's definitely dead this is about 10.30pm, I'm all packed up for the evening, I've put the rifle away and this rat comes out for a wander either he's out to taunt me because he knows I've packed up or he's out looking for his little friend this is where I shot the rat in the head earlier on in the evening if he's looking for him he's too late, he's in ratty heaven along with 13 others that's 14 shot all together and there's the three I recovered Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.